Hey everybody, hope everybody is doing well. Today we are gonna do a pour over on a record. Record. I have this hair catcher that goes in the shower drain. We're just gonna set that on there. I'm not sure if I wanna do it that way or this way. We're gonna do it that way. We're gonna just set that in the middle. The record, I rubbed it with some rubbing alcohol to clean it, get all the fingerprints off. I've got the hole taped from the backside so paint doesn't strain through it. And I primed it with the two-in-one Rust-Oleum paint primer. It's a satin paint because they didn't have flat. The only flat I have is in white. So, um, and it's just like a light blue color. Once I get my gloves on, we can get started. <laughs> okay. So the colors we have today are Artist Loft Brilliant Blue, Artist Loft Cronacodome Magenta, Artist Loft Brilliant Yellow, Artist Loft, wait, no, Basics Light Green Hue, and then Artist Loft Cardacodome, no, not Cardacodome, <laughs> um, Cerulean Blue, and this glove does not want to go on. My hands got too hot, I think. Florida, I'm telling you. Humidity makes a lot of things outside impossible. <laughs> okay, good enough. Okay, we are just going to do a clean pour into the thing, so I'm just going to see what order I want my paints in. go like this. So we've got the brilliant blue going in first. It doesn't look like it's making much of a pattern, but we shall see. And then the brilliant yellow. the light green and then the cerulean blue none of these colors have silicone Just gonna do a couple rounds and then we'll stretch it out, see what we get. Paints might be a little thin. There it's not really keeping the shape that I wanted. But that's fine. I think it'll still look neat. I'm going to forego the yellow the next round, though.
we're just gonna let it drain for a moment. Set the colors aside. twisting it as I'm taking it out. Right. Set that right behind me. I'm gonna go ahead and give this a torch. what we get. There is a whole lot of paint on there. trying to get some of that paint off without totally ruining the design. right there. Okay, let me wipe my hands. Okay, there we go. I like that better. covering up where my hand was. Okay. Now we're just going to do a light torch to pop the bubbles. And I will show you a close-up at the end of the video. So I appreciate everybody for watching and I hope you have a great day. Please let me know what you think about it in the comments below. Thanks so much everybody. Take care. Okay, just a quick close up. Sorry for the glare ahead of time. It's 
very bright and sunny out. So. I know I stretched it a little too much, but I kind of like the design. So let me know what you think in the comments below.